So welcome to my office. We're out here today uh, doing university work and this work is uh, professional development of doctors and nurses and a few naturopaths and a couple of psychologists and they've joined us from Western Australia, South Australia, Queensland, Victoria, New South Wales and we're here to listen to Professor Stephen Myers talk about naturopathy, complementary medicine and how it works with lifestyle medicine and rather than doing it in the classroom or in the doctor's surgery we thought we'd bring it outdoors where it matters and where people might remember the adventure. Uh, this is a great opportunity for education. Uh, the neurobiologists tell us that uh, we learn best when we're actually moving. That's the reason that we've got those appendages called legs. Part of what we're doing uh, on this edu venture is to have a conversation as we're walking down the beach and through uh, various trails that uh, uh, lead through this national park. In the evening we're having more formal lectures that uh, form part of professional development but part of the benefit of these edu ventures is the conversation uh, we have with our colleagues and the professional academics as we're walking down the trail. So this is the, uh, the Sand and River and we have the ferryman, Rob and Kathy, are uh, going to take us over and come back and get the rest of the group, We're a, a big group of about uh, 18 uh, this time. And uh, as they say, you know, you don't pay the ferryman until you get to the other side, but... <laughs> <laughs> which is what I've done. Fantastic locale around here though, you can see the, uh, the Sand and River that leads up into the into the wilderness up there and there's the uh, little island off the, this, this is Plover Island uh, out there as well. So we're into the second day of the walk, the third night, and we'll be heading off to Woolai when we get to the other side of the river. We had no idea just how much we'd get from it. We, um, we thought we'd get fit and we thought we'd learn about complementary medicine and lifestyle medicine, but walking along a beautiful beach like this, I can have a conversation that that really means something. So here we are day two, and we're at Mini Waters, and there's been about 45 kilometers of walking, and there's been about six hours of lectures, and lots of networking and talking. We've called it the Walk the Talk Walk. Because we're looking at lifestyle medicine, and, and many of the pillars of lifestyle medicine are about exercise, nutrition, and balance in your life, and especially the balance in your life thing we, we talked about last night as one of our lectures, is enough that especially professional people, busy people, family people don't get enough of. So this walk is indeed talking to us about how we balance ourselves. The stress levels of all the participants are down, the knowledge levels are up, the enjoyment levels are outstanding. This has been a wonderful synthesis of everything that matters to me in healing, in self-management, in health promotion. We have been practicing what we preach. We have been walking along the beach and getting fitter and I can feel that. We've been having evening sessions in, in lifestyle medicine and complementary medicine which have in, engendered really interesting conversations along the way in this edge venture and I would thoroughly recommend that anybody who is interested in learning more about complementary medicine or lifestyle medicine considers practicing what they preach and actually going out there in the environment and doing it. I've just done a three-day walk from Manguri to Red Rock through the beautiful Yurugir National Park on the north coast of New South Wales. And I've done this uh, with the Southern Cross University uh, in the company of uh, Gary Egger and Stephen Myers, professors in lifestyle medicine. And I've learned a hell of a lot. Uh, why'd I do it? Well, probably first and foremost, I needed a stress break and this provided a perfect opportunity for that. And uh, I've done it in the company of some wonderful people, some doctors, some naturopaths, some psychologists and the odd chemist. And uh, it's just been wonderful. And I'd recommend it to anybody. I think every doctor should do this. Absolutely. <laughs> 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 Yay! <laughs>